on the latest episode of LTC Heroes, Michelle Gramolia, president and CEO of the Whitland Pond at New Paltz, joined our Peter Murphy Lewis to share how LTC organizations can effectively collaborate with the wider community. One of Gramolia's innovative ideas was to open a bank branch right there in her facility. They will offer all of banking services to the residents, to our staff that want to participate. They will have safe deposit boxes here on campus, which is new. The prior relationship didn't have that. It's convenient. You know, our, our employees can bank there. They can do their Christmas clubs. They can, you know, do different things. Gromalia also formed a partnership with Woodland Ponds local pharmacy. And now it's a match made in heaven. It's open six days a week with their staff. There's not a pharmacist here, but it's otherwise a full drugstore. You can get any kind of over-the-counter medication, your incontinence products, cutest gifts you've ever seen. It's a gift shop. And now the prescriptions come in with the store operator. They're in a secure setting. You know, they pick up, they come pick things up every day. And she facilitated a collaboration with a local Institute of Learning for Seniors. The Lifetime Learning Institute is a non-credit course spring uh, program that's actually designed and administered by the State University of New Paltz here uh, in town. So we have smart classroom, conference rooms, other community spaces that the Lifetime Learning Institute, they take the registrations for the courses and then they send their instructors here or oftentimes our residents are the instructors, but again, all coordinated through SUNY New Paltz. To hear the full episode, click on the link in the description below or go to ltcheroes.com. Don't forget to check out our blogs at experience.care slash blog. The link will be in the description below as well. If you like this content, subscribe and leave a comment. We'll see you next time.